guys, good morning. I arrived in Bad um, and it's about a two hour drive from Cape Town. We've been here before uh, last year in February and we decided to spend the last weekend um, on holiday before I go back to the grindstone. But I want to show you the place that we're staying at. It is a place called Geliki and it's a popular wedding venue, but they do have like accommodation on the property we got the property which was very fortunate to get because usually this time of the year everything is fully booked and I couldn't believe it that this place was still available but let me just give you a quick little tour of this little place <laughs> and a lovely day bed which I think is adorable oh, I'm gonna spend my time reading here and then I see they've got like a little outside area. It's got benches and stuff. But that's about it. And then it's got a black patio table and trees. With an owl probably have breakfast out here if it's not windy and a dry area. I love how rustic and antique the deco is. It's such a button the thing. Okay, let's go inside. Okay, so this is like a one open space. Say hello, Courtney. Hello, everyone. And it's just got the basics. You can see how Betty's over there. The bathroom. So cute. And it's got like an open shower. So there's no door. Uh, a cupboard to just sort of put our things in. And there's a little TV for us. Uh, and then this space over here is just where the gas stove is and all the crockery and cutlery is. And the basin. That's about it so we're here for the entire weekend and we're not gonna be doing much usually when we are on holiday we would like book places to eat because in Patanusi you have to book beforehand you can't just rock up because it's really really one of the most popular small towns and everybody wants to be here so yeah I'll show you guys Mostly, I'm really relaxed. I've got two of my reading books here, so I'm going to just sit back and relax and just enjoy the time of coffee. woke up like now I think it's just after 8 so yes this is my morning wake up <laughs> look I'm going for and um, I want to show you what this morning looks like mm. so pretty as much as the sun is out the wind is blowing and we were hoping to go down to the beach today and spend some time there because the last time we were here we didn't have chance to really like spend some time down there we drove around doing actual blogging work instead of being on holiday like we are now so I'm gonna get the breakfast done put me to make his own eggs I'm not in the egg department and let's see we're gonna get make some bacon some pork bangers and then Kota's got his egg some coffee this is a gas stove so 
in lot of the accommodations guest stoves are the easiest to work with and also it's just um it's faster as well by cooking your food it's just the easiest method to regard and then i think we've got some rolls let me just check yes some rolls if you want like and toasted i end up toasting mine and that's breakfast we weren't gonna go out for breakfast we're gonna go out for lunch to one of Courtney's favorite restaurants we went to when we were here hoping that they have place I'm actually just gonna go and see if they do have a table for us I mean we'll see how that goes and I'll show you guys the rest of our day yeah what they had you the last time and to see if they still have it so that's pretty good. It was really nice that's why I want to come out again. But this is the source of the fish. Yeah so we're hoping that they'll be able to accommodate him. What is this game called? Puzzle Bubble. Puzzle Bubble. So he asked me if I've ever played this game before and I was like no, never heard of it. He says we should get the balls now. Why like with me? Because this is like a true 90s game. But I've never played it before. Then I need to take you to a game center. I don't think you there's any game center. You know the anyway, we're getting the balls now because I've never played this game. I'll never divorce you. <laughs> okay, we're officially checking out of Khaliki and it was such a nice, peaceful holiday that you needed. Oh, do you have everything? Yeah? Yeah. This looks like a normal pizza. Um, how can I say it? It's like. But it's a grasshopper. Yeah, it's a grasshopper thing. Okay. Anyway, so uh, we are off to have some coffee and a little bit of carrot cake from Montfall down the road. We've never been there when we were here the last time, so it will be nice to go and see what they have to offer just a throw, throw stone away so let's go see
is this me? When you do, when I come in the kitchen, you always tell me, um, oh, I'm not saying how to blah blah blah. But then what do I do? I still stand there. Look at this time. Uh, yeah, they say that I suppose. This is a little bit. So dad can't cook much, but he helps mom cook by standing next to her and telling her that it smells nice. He didn't chop a single onion, but they're laughing and burning in peace. Let's do sometimes just give me this.